Today we're going to make pizza. And the first thing you need is bread. I got a loaf of rosemary focaccia bread in the supermarket. Uh, you go to the bakery aisle, don't go to the bread aisle. If it has high fructose corn syrup, it's not bread. Not real bread anyway. And uh, through the magic of television, it's already been sliced in half. Now, if you go to a pizza shop, Sicilian pizzas, like this one's going to be, uh, they actually bake the dough once before putting on the sauce and the cheese because it's so thick. But since we already just took a loaf, slice in half, I'm going to put it down right there. To make the tomato sauce, the things you're going to need is one can of tomato paste, one can's worth of water, and a can of tomato sauce, which I've already mixed up here. Then we're going to take some crushed garlic, about half a teaspoon, just throw that in. Grind up some pepper. Add some salt. And a healthy couple of dashes of Italian seasoning. And we're going to stir that all in and we'll have our sauce. Now we're going to put everything together. First thing, ladle on some sauce. Probably have a little bit left over. And just spread it out there. A nice coat all over the place. And we have some fresh uh, grated mozzarella cheese. We're gonna sprinkle that on, spread it out. And this might end up being a bit of an extra cheese pie. That's fine, because I like a lot of cheese. We have a handful of fresh basil leaves, which I'm just gonna place around the pie. And the oven's been preheated to 450 degrees. So it looks like we're all ready to go. And we'll just throw that in. As you can see, I put uh, tomatoes on one piece as well. And it uh, goes in the oven for 450 for about 10 minutes. And we're all set. I'm ready to eat. 